Friday, October 20th. Please stand and join us in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Welcome back, Lions! To another great broadcast of MTV News, News at 10. 10. I'm your host, Prince Gill. I'm your co-host, Maddie Shirley. And this is General Information. It's time to register for the Fall Multicultural Fair. If you're interested in performing or hosting a lunch booth, register using the link or the AMHS app today. Registration will be due by Friday. The bookkeeper's office will be closed today, but it will reopen on Monday. Students, you must have a parking pass if you want to park on campus. If there's any student that parks in the staff parking lot, you will be ticketed. On Thursday, November 9th, Auburn Mountain View will be hosting a Veterans Day lunch to honor those who have served or are currently serving our country. If you're interested in hosting a veteran, come to the activities office to sign up today. Tell me, Siri, how's the season looking? My season's looking good, actually. Win this game, playoffs, automatic. That's you know. good. And when is your game? We have a game tonight against Decatur at 7. Be there. Support. Show up. Be there. I'm here with Cross Country star Andrew Roder. Tell me, Andrew, what's your guys' record looking like? Uh, we're 5-2 and two this year. That's great. That's really good. Tell me, when's your guys' next race? Uh, we have sub-districts tomorrow at 9.30 in the morning. Wow. You hear that? Be there. Hi guys, I'm here with Hannah Mayers from the AMHS Girls Swim and Dive team. So tell us, how's the season going? Uh, it's going pretty good. I heard you guys had your senior night last week. How was that? Super fun. <laughs> When's your guys' next meet? Uh, I know we have leagues on the 21st, so this Saturday. This Saturday. You hear that, guys? Be there. Hi, guys. I'm here with the golf star, Shiley McConnell. You know, she's the OG. Um, so, how did your golf season go? Uh, pretty good. We brought five of our girls to the league tournament this week, and four of us made it to the state qualifiers this spring. Wow, that's exciting. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Go Lions. <laughs> Go Lions. We're standing here on beautiful autumn day with Grant Harris, king of the tennis courts. Now Grant, tell me how your season is going so far. It's going pretty good. We went 4-1 and one in the crossover tournament and now we are fifth seed in districts. That's fantastic. Now there is a rumor going around that you and Nate Wheeldryer are the best doubles team out there. Now yeah. is that true? Uh, well, I'm not going to say it, but the stats don't lie. All right, well, you heard it here first, folks. Grant Harris. We're sitting here with the captain of the water polo team, Jack Bush. Now Jack, tell me how your game went last night. It was close, but we pulled it out and came off with the W, if you know what I'm saying. That's what I like to hear. All right, so your next game is this Monday. Who are you guys playing? We are playing Kennedy again at their pool. Be there. All right, and your senior night is next Thursday, is that right? Yeah, that is correct. We are playing Kentwood at 7.30. All right, they're going to get the W on Thursday. Everybody be there. Come support senior night on Thursday at Auburn High School. We're sitting here with 14-year-old freshman, golf phenom, Cole Reynolds. Cole, how are you doing today? Good, how are you? I'm doing great, thanks. So I heard that last Tuesday you played sixth in districts out of 100 kids for golf. Yeah, I did. Wow, that, that's something special. 14 years old, beating, and they're any age, right? They're all yes. older than you for the most part. Yeah. Yeah, so you're just that good. You're nasty. Mm -hmm. Jeez. Okay. So, you qualified straight to state for getting six. What about anybody else from Mountain View? Do they qualify? Uh, both end did shooting even par the first day and 80 the second day. And what did you shoot, Cole? Uh, I shot 78 the first day and 77 the second day. All right, and last question. When is your state match? Uh, during the spring. This spring. All right, you heard it here first, folks. Look out for Cole Reynolds. Watch out, Tiger. Hello, Lions. We're sitting here with freshman class ASV president, Osta Blacody. How do you feel about being newly elected? I just want to thank everyone. I'm very excited to be part of the freshman ASB. What are your plans for this year? I plan to make Auburn Mountain View great again by making the freshmen so more support so we can finally beat the seniors in a pep rally. Alright Lions, I'm here with freshman class vice president-elect Will Cresswell. And Will, I know it was a really hard election and there was a lot of like pressure, but what are the plans for this year? I just want to make our Mountain View just better it can. And how do you plan on doing that? Just making it better in every way. Making freshman student body have more spirit. And there's this rumor going around that 
You're gonna beat the senior class in the pep assembly. It's gonna happen. No, it's not. Stay tuned. In Career Center news, we have some great colleges visiting us today. We have Montana State Bozeman, Seattle Pacific University, and Eastern Washington University. Come check out those colleges today in the Career Center. Are you interested in attending Pacific Lutheran University and have a 3.7 GPA or higher? Come see Mrs. Dahmet in the Career Center today for a great scholarship opportunity. Hey, hey Lions, our book drive just started this last Monday and it's continuing into next week, so uh, bring in your books. And this is just a continuation of the Harvey Relief Fund where we'll be donating to Smith Academy, my old elementary school, Shotwell Middle School, and Houston Davis High School. So uh, bring in your books and thanks for your support. I'm standing here with soccer superstar Chloe Bakion. Hey guys, there's a girls soccer game today after school at 3.30. Hey, be, be there. there. Come by Monday to try our new and improved quesadilla sauce. Dear, Dear boys, boys, we got the sauce. Hey, are you interested in playing boys basketball? Well, come to the gym right after school today. Good morning, Auburn Mountain View students. Just a reminder about some of our school rules. We do have a dress code, and this dress code was created by students, parents, and faculty. So I, it, this should be posted in every single room and if you aren't sure if you're breaking the dress code, this visual is pretty self-explanatory and if you don't get it from the visual, there are some pretty clear expectations. Um, bellies we shouldn't be showing, um, sunglasses aren't allowed, hats and head coverings um, and bandanas are not allowed at all. If you have a scarf on your head, it shouldn't be more than three inches wide. And um, this has been a rule, and it's a safety rule about head coverings. When students come into our building that don't belong to Auburn Mountain View, we can know immediately by, um, by them having a hat on or a hood and refusing to take it off. So it's not an exception for anyone and a teacher shouldn't have to continually ask you to take it off. If you've been asked two or three times to take off your hood or your hat by a teacher, it's becoming insubordination. So let's make sure we follow our own rules and everyone gets along and we can do the right thing. Go Lions! Each student, each staff, every day, be intentional. And remember, Lions, make every day a great day here at Auburn Mountain View.